your materials today. You'll have two temperature sensors, a small metal cup and a large styrofoam cup, as well as your trusty iPad. Constant 80 mils of water goes in the styrofoam cup. That'll be like a water bath. The metal cup will go inside the water bath. One thermometer will go in the space between, so outside the metal cup. The other thermometer goes inside the metal cup. So you'll be able to measure the temperature inside and outside simultaneously. When you do this, please rest this thermometer on the edge of the cup. That will keep it suspended at a reasonable depth in the water. The one that's inside the metal cup can just go at an angle like so. As you learned yesterday, you can measure the initial temperature of the water using these numbers here. The amount of water you microwave is a variable. So follow the instructions. Sometimes it says 40 milliliters and sometimes it says 80. Again, you microwave in the glass beaker and will transfer to the metal cup. If you are using this microwave next to the distilled water jug, you can read the label. It says microwave for 45 seconds instead of one minute. Only in this microwave. It's more powerful than the others in the room. More powerful means it delivers more joules per second. So this is my hot water from the microwave. Equilibrate in the glass first, about 10 seconds, and then it's easier with two people. Transfer thermometer and hot water, and press the start button so you begin collecting data. If you move these thermometers, you'll likely see random spikes on your graph, so just let it sit and you should get very nice data. Yesterday you collected data for, for a specific amount of time, but today you need to keep collecting data until your graphs level off. So that may take more than four minutes, so just use your judgment, but you can see that one leveled off. This one's almost leveled off. I'm changing the calculator position, so they were on this position on the outside at the top, but now they're going to go down here, right on top of the crossbar where they can't fall. So they're a little harder to see, but they are more secure and less likely to fall on the ground. Please do not put a calculator here, it'll fall in the trash. Instead, put it here.